Good boy. Come on, Beanie. All the way up. Yes. Good job. Good job. Wait. 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 Oh. Up, up. Up, up. Okay. Wait. Wait. Okay, come. This way. This way. Good. Good. Boy. Good. Come. Good. Up up. Up up. Very good. Good boy. Good job. Wait. So for this exercise, we're working a lot on maintaining focus, placing, sit, stay, and then releasing. This will be really good to help really with guiding Beanie. Yes, good boy, this way, come. And helping to build that patience as well. Good boy. Yes. Good. Good. Very good. Good boy. Nice. Good, wait. Wait. Uh -uh. Nice. Okay. Wait. Okay, come. Good boy. Good. Yes, this way. Place. Very good. Come. Good 
Good. Nice. Good. Wait. Wait. Oh, good wait. There you go. Wait. Okay, come. Very good, thank you. So the reason why we want to build his patience and his ability to wait is going to really help with regaining his concentration and composure when meeting people when he gets excited. And then it can also be applied to his counter surfing, jumping behaviors. Pretty much when he sees something that he wants to impulsively kind of react to and go towards, if we teach him and practice with him and make him feel rewarded for waiting until we release him, then all those other exercises will be a lot easier. So we're really going through a lot of just the basics for, for Beanie here. Come. Good boy. They were doing some yard work after it rained. So, it's a place. Good boy. Okay, wait. 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 Good. And all I'm doing there is just reinforcing the wait or the stay when he tries to move preemptively. And just getting him used to sitting still, even though there's a lot going on for an extended period of time. Okay, we'll try that again. Okay. okay. All the way up. Wait. Wait. Good, come. Good. Okay. Trying to get Beanie here used to seeing all sorts of distractions, hearing things, everything happening around him, and then him actually still being able to re remain composed and continue to focus on me. Good boy. I know, what's that, huh? What's that? Place. Oh, <laughs> careful, stay. Stay. Uh -uh. Stay. Good, good stay. Wait. Back up. Good boy. Wait. No. Back up. Okay. Wait. Uh uh. Wait. Good. Wait. Almost. Back up. Okay, come. 
Good job. There you go. Good job. If he needs additional help waiting, we could always use the leash to help hold him on there. But I really want him to try to do as much of it on his own as possible. He'll fail a few times just because he gets distracted. But it's just more opportunities for us to really get used to correcting him at that proper time, asking him to wait. Let me do it one more time. Good boy. I'm gonna try to do it often enough that he gets to that point where he just kind of waits automatically and kind of gives up until we, we call him to wait, until we call him to release. And this is how you would just do it if you, you think he needed some more help, wait. Uh-uh, wait. Wait. Sit. Good, sit. Almost got it. There you go, good job. Wait. And that's how you would help him with those minor corrections and holding him until he's able to do it. Good. Very good. Yes, there you go. And all I'm looking for is for him to kind of get distracted, maybe look like he's going to move, and then just reinforce that sit-stay. Very good. Okay, let's go. There we go. Good boy. Very good. All right. So you want him to sit, stay, get distracted, remain composed, keep focused, and then release on command. Good boy. Good job.